back to the game. Back to the old scary grind. Yes, we're back in the peaceful part of the game. Yeah, the best part of the game, actually. Actually, the best part was jumping out that window. So far, probably the highlight, yeah. I liked it. I like the fountains. Oh. oh. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I won't, Herbert. There is no shame in using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. <laughs> the shame will hurt much less than dying. I, I assure, assure you. That's a weird memory to have. Yeah. Daniel. I hope someone somewhere has made a life-size recreation of this fountain. Oh, God. Oh. A room? No! Oh. Oh. You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. So, Ooh. you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum of Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the Hey, Regent Park. Go there. This one might be a little longer. Nice. And in the other direction. Creepy, man. So I think the set this game's set like kinda of in the past. No, like seventeen hundreds? I don't know about seventeen hundreds. Because it's not actually no, George elevator. Washington. Elevator. And there's an elevator in it. Eight late eighteen hundreds. potentially. <laughs> I think I said 17 because of George Washington. <laughs> yeah. I definitely said that. It's definitely 1776. <laughs> uh, I believe this is Independence Hall. This is the basement. They don't let you see it on the tour. <laughs> this is where the Illuminati meet, right? Oh, God. Yo, don't get me started on that shit. I I read a lot of conspiracy theories as a, like a, a teenager. Yeah. It creeped me out, man. About the Illuminati. Would you ever have guessed that? The use of fixed Oh yeah, that's out? right. Yeah, because I had the instructions. <laughs> yeah. The machine. Oh my god. How am I supposed to do anything? Everything's locked. The market day room. There was that other door you didn't go through yet. What other door? There's a door at the other end of this room. It had stairs and you said, Nope. And then you walked away. I don't remember Ow! My this bad. Th this one? No, that's where you came in. Okay. It's uh that one. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my god. I don't want to go to. I had to save the creepy one for last. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. Yep. They really need push and pull signs in this place. Mm -hmm. Storage. Oh man, that storage sounds is the worst terrifying. part ever. <laughs> uh, fine. Professor Taylor was the second death caused by his damn curiosity. Damn you, Daniels! <laughs> Blah. Nice and dark in here. Good start. No windows. No. Uh, oh my no lights. god! No light whatsoever. Lots of uh, spookiness and a box and bad music. <laughs> do you have uh, do you have enough tinder boxes? No. Well, there's one. Uh, what is this? I bet it's a head. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Let's go, Daniel. Oh. <laughs> Oh god. No! Get away from me! Leave me alone! That's... That's... Oh, that's dark. I think storage might have meant people storage. Oh god! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Not the stairway. I don't like going down. It won't budge, Daniel. Duh. Fuck the storage. You just 
wrote a note. Can you see what that was? I just wrote a note? Yeah. Oh, hold on. You know, it's it's a little creepy that there are candles that's that's still lit. Yeah, that's true. You you wrote a note. Okay. Like yeah. in your I just wanted to investigate the area a little more and then I'll look at it. Okay. Yo chill, I'm good. I think it was a note. This one? No. So what it was the original the note. one? What was it? What what was the things besides notes? Mementos? Oh. oh. The rubble from the caves hindering for the path is to storage. Find a way to get through. Okay. That's all it says. Okay. Oh, also go back. What? The darkness in the storage feels strange oh and unnatural. Oh my god. Why did, why did you make me go back? <laughs> what do you mean unnatural? This whole fucking place is unnatural. But this this place in Th particular. This particular, yeah. Apparently it's too too unnatural. You have to fucking say it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh okay. Gravity. Strange and unnatural. Oh my god. Light. Oh, pitch black. Shit, I gotta find a way around, huh? What'd that say? <laughs> Instruments. Oh. Do you think it's musical instruments? <laughs> no. <laughs> Do you think it's surgical instruments? <laughs> Worse. Ooh. Oh god. This is... Well, unrusted, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. What? Did you hear that? Yeah. It's hard to say though, as you go on, what parts of this game are just your yourself going insane. Yeah. Bathe me in your steam. Oh. I'll drill you. Way to lighten up the mood. <laughs> you gotta every now and then. And gulp. <sighs> Instruments, Daniel. Oh man, this room is real scary. Oh, I got a lot of oil still. Yeah, of course storage. It's the scariest. You have to know what coming in. Oh, the money chest. Oh, thank you. Just fat loot there. Yeah, that was great loot. Oh, God. Tinder box. I just want to lock myself in this room and just... Anything else here? I guess that's it. I mean, it is storage, so yeah. it's a lot of bullshit. You did pick up a couple useful things already. Yeah. Am I supposed to find all three um, of the things I need? You definitely need more stuff to fix the elevator, mm. it was implied. And some way to get into the machine room, which was locked. Oh, right, yeah. Oh wait, there it is. Uh, all rods are inserted. I don't know about that. I mean, if as long as you haven't explored everything and you can't figure out where to go, you always just need to explore where you haven't been yet. Yeah. Pretty much. You'll pretty probably much find the, something you need. Pretty much how this game works. 
Yay. <laughs> Nobody it's, saw that. The accuracy is fantastic. <laughs> All that modern warfare is really helping us out on the mouse accuracy. <gasps> Another drill part. Combined, okay. I hate friends on Facebook to just invite all their friends to something. Oh, to an event? Yeah, me too. Like, come on. What kind of event you got there, buddy? Be selective. I got invited to a... That's a, la that's a lazy man's way to invite people. I don't even know what this is. Something at school. See, at first I'm like, oh, I'm flattered to be invited to your event. And then you realize... Everybody on our friends list was invited. Yeah. Was and that like, there was a party last night that I wasn't invited to. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, no, I don't want to eat lunch with you. I want to eat a Hot Pocket and cry in my room. <laughs> Alone. Uh, women's rights in Islam. There you go. Talk. I think they just had that at Temple. Well, anyway. Uh, this episode, I know it's been a... A pretty active one, but we're gonna have to cut it here. Oh man! Too much action for one episode. That's what the producer is telling me. <laughs> we're supposed to break it up, take it a little slowly. Oh, so. always gotta listen to our producers. Yeah. All right. So thanks, Dave. Uh, <laughs> see you guys next time. Wild West, right? Yeah. We're talking like John Wayne. Talking about like <laughs> talking about like George, not George Clooney. Um, Clint Eastwood. Clint Eastwood. Are, are we talking about um? John Wayne vs. Clint Eastwood, the game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, so genius. We are good.